Hey, Instagram, it's me, T, from the past since taking trains to bed. Ooh, what a, whatever days it's been since the, since the, what, the 22nd of July, and whatever day this is, we've been doing, dealing with the uh, food and daba, or like I like to say, the food dialogues, no, no, rackets dialogues, and daba, of course, it's more from the food dialogues to the share to food and daba, because it's got bigger than just dialoguing about food and issues and stuff like that. It's an issue that, that brings together like academics and and uh, uh, people in the field of, uh, of food um, and uh, and uh, you know chefs and and workers whatever but, no, I'm saying whatever but every year it gets bigger and bigger and it's kind of interesting because we had a, a, a sort of like I don't know what to say it's a closing ceremony like a like a uh, an acknowledgement ceremony of all the workers it's just the workers were there right I mean the people that work. Uh, in uh, within the food uh, food and dava, and uh, uh, what was interesting is that uh, this is the first year they did this kind of thing. So so he and the grandmaster, you know, he's a what am I talking about? The head is, is Kirk Ackerman. Don't worry about that part. But uh, but Ian is like the master. So he's giving out chocolates to all the people like that. So it came to my my turn because see the thing is I I joined them when they did this new step like three years ago when they started. Uh, so they started one place and then they started doing the waterfront game and things so now they're like bigger and bigger so I came in, in this particular time period when they got bigger and bigger like, you know, like that uh, and um, uh, it's really strange not strange but I've been a part or I've been let me put it this way we're on, we're on Instagram if you look at my Instagram profile it says I'm a witness traveler and that's exactly what it is I've been a witness in a, uh, to a lot of initiatives that are like amazing I mean really amazing uh, I mean, worldwide. Um, so, this is one of them. Anyway, uh, so it's a, I don't want to say it's a celebration. In fact, here's the thing. Uh, Miss Nilly Fuller Jr. says, you know, we shouldn't be celebrating, you know, until, until, until we end racism and replace, it with, and replace it with a system of justice. There is no celebration. So, you got a lot of people, they celebrate this, they celebrate that. You know, somebody gets... Uh, a name out there, and they hope they're celebrating this and celebrating that. They talk bad about people. In fact, I saw something on the internet too. Uh, Don Cornelius, I, I, I met Don Cornelius one time, uh, St. John Divine Church. Don't matter. Uh, uh, but you know, he said something that was very interesting because they was criticizing him for Soul Train. He's a, the, the progenitor of Soul Train, and uh, and they were talking bad or whatever, whatever. Like, like they do now over the internet and stuff like that. We've got people got beef. He said. I don't know why people, basically he said, let me just paraphrase, he said, I don't know why uh, black people should be talking talking about each other, bad about each other. They could just take that same energy and do what they're supposed to do and zip, which is my point of view, you know what I mean? There's no need, unless nearly full of Jews said the same thing. You shouldn't be talking, there's no need to talk bad about something, or criticize, you can criticize the situation, sure. When you start getting personal, bring names in and stuff like that, even if they're political figures, why? Especially if they're a political figure or even an entertainer, because they're doing what they do and you're reacting to them. <laughs> well, you should be doing what you do and let them react to you if you're doing something right. I mean, if you if you're doing justice, then they have to react to justice. If, if this, these people are doing what they're doing and 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 it's unjust, then you're reacting to injustice, which means that you're you're in that wheel that that the backwash of injustice. That's what happens when the uh, like the, some people call the dominant system or the system of of, uh, of white supremacy, or I call it Anglo white supremacy. Well, it's like you wash it in the backwash, and the energy that you, you all, Miss Neil Fuller Jr. also says it, all we have is time and energy. Now, if you take your time and your energy constantly you know, battling their backwash that they keep on flooding down to you, well, that's what you're doing, right? Anyway, I don't know why I got off on that, but well, I do know why I got off on that. It's because we need to stop celebrating. You know, the Olympics is here, you know, okay, you want to celebrate somebody doing something good. And, Spend your time watching the Olympics. I got over the Olympics a long time. No, no I mean, let's say, do, do what you need to do. Cheer and like, yay. And, you know, feel good. Yay. Your team, yay. Um, or your person, yay. That's, that, that's, that's fine and daddy. But uh, the overall thing, if you really want to just wear a world, then you have to, uh, well, you got you to put your time and energy into something else. Anyway, I went with this whole thing just to, just to share with you uh, the uh, the Quinsalva that I wrote um, um, for the, the, all us workers in the in the, the food dialogues this this year, or as we say, the food and Dava this year, 
uh, I got to take my glasses off. I don't know, my reading glasses are in bonds. I don't know why I can't remember. It's hard for me to read those. I can't, I can't even read my own writing. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> so I, I, I shared this with the, uh, with the, with the gathering today. Um, I messed up a few words there, but I'm going to try to, you know, do it right so we'll, it'll be recorded. <laughs> uh, the name of, oh, just in case you don't know, uh, Kunsaba is a 49-word poem. It exists on uh, seven, it's seven uh, lines of seven words per line. Each word has to be um, less than seven letters, well, seven letters or less, right? Uh, except for proper nouns. So this is a, uh, this is called, this one is called uh, Out of the Umbra, D, like D-E, because I, I do the D-E a lot. Because that, that gives me, uh, how you say, uh, uh, um, acknowledgement to my uh, uh, Della Gicci, uh background. My maternal side is Bill Gitchi. Anyway, uh, so it's out of, uh, out of the umbra. Now, umbra is like an umbrella, but it's like umbra is like the darkness, you know? Now, all this work is, I'm talking specifically about the, the, the background workers, because this is, well, the background workers. You know, as you know, in, in theater, we, we used to dress in black, you know, <laughs> so people will see us, you know, we move set stuff around on set, and whatever, you know, your background. And, uh, and you, and, and so when I say out of umbra, this is like a, the workers, you know, that you don't see uh, because they're, you know, their their background. Okay, it's a consaba of service. Like the helpful they seek of being, like the reveals holding import of outcome, coming to visible to vanish in sight. They be of renown each dawning day. Vital in every crucial ease of way. Reason is their being towards ensuing service. We smile all our praises of you. That's my consaba of, uh, of service to people who give service. You know, like a, you know, like your stage managers, which I, 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 I'm, I'm direct to say as well. That's my thing. And uh, people in the background, people do a who do what they do, right? So that was it. I talked to you the, today. Was a, just a you know like a, it's a Sunday, so I do what I do. On Mondays we talk about me. It's a me day. Talking about me. Uh, uh, Tuesdays is uh, U.S. politics. Wednesday is world politics. Thursdays is audio drama. We talk about audio drama, or my specifically my audio drama world and what's and what we're doing. Uh, Friday is a is a, a wrap up day. Uh, Saturday is a day like today. Sunday, whatever it's come to mind. All right? Okay, check you all later. Bye. See you.